and your network drive or NFC in uh, in your XPMC how to add it in so for that first I'm going to inst start uh, uh, XPMC application uh, app I'm going to launch the XPMC player so second thing you just need to go to videos file add video browse you gotta browse the uh, network location where from where you where you're going to access your videos from so it's a windows network it's much easier in that way so it's going to now it's in work group so work group the network nfc drive which i have installed on my network i have given a name of a backup drive so uh, so obviously it's all configured in that way so I just press the backup drive and normally where I keep the videos is uh, in uh, my case is on uh, volume number two uh, because it's two drives in a one NFC server so volume number two and it's working through as you know that as yeah and you just dedicate you detect him to sorry sorry you set the right folder up okay I set the videos folder is low it's working so it's gonna check in there what's in there <coughs> okay he's go he's here I got all my videos and everything in there in different different folders some are, are some are in the folders some are in subfolders some are on in, in under the same directory even so what will happen I'm just going to add them press ok by pressing ok I just gave him the address from where the XPMC going to load the videos so once you do that you press the OK button again on it in the bottom so you let it work it sometimes takes a bit of time okay all right now the thing is your videos are already been added into it but to what you wanted to do actually you wanted to create a list list in terms of I want him, to, want him to show me only movies so what I'm going to do I'm going to scrap the movies so what will happen now I tell him search in this folder whatever movies you can find and name them and arrange them sort of way so that means whatever movies I have got inside they can be arranged properly uh, in my list in my list on the desktop so on the desktop of the media player so I'm going to select like what I want from you to do now what he's going to do so I want to I'm asking him to create me a shortcut for the movies he's going to create me a shortcut for the movies and and search every every file which is in the in the location which I already told him I already told the XBMC and match it match them all with these websites he's going to match the information with on the website and also goes on YouTube to find the trailers for the film as well just to make it more easier so I'm asking him to search for that one as well okay so I'm asking him to movies are separate in separate folder I'm just telling him everything so yes excluding libraries contain all these things and everything you just go then press ok and I was gonna create a movie folder do you want so would you like to refresh the information in this item path yes I would like to there we go now it's gonna create a clean up a library and make up a library for me so this process may take uh, may take some time and depend upon the size of your NFCs. Actually, I have got about 800 movies, so it takes quite good time for my my for my device to work on. But what will have is is sort of ready to access sort of information. So and now I'm going to show you where to where once this process is finished, I'm going to show you where you can access your movies and all these things. So once it's done. What you will see, you will see this video folder right here. This video folder, if you click it here, even you can easily access your movies, and all these folders will appear up here. So it's working through, so it's connecting to it. It all depends upon. So these all videos are there for you. So these all are videos there for you to watch. Also, okay, if you go on home page again, how how you think you're gonna access it all? So as you can see that from here. There you go, these all are here for you. So what will, what will happen, once everything will be set up and all these things running automatically, once you repower it, as you see that, just keep on adding it, keep on adding it. If you go to libraries, 
it's already added the movies in there so you can show the movies so the way to access it you go to videos you already on it and press the libraries there you go in movies then and now you can select any title you want you know how you want it also separates all movies in terms of uh, how they are title year actors directors studio country tags you know whatever you want it will it will, it will sort them out for you that way let's suppose i want to do for years it's going to show you the list of years what what list you're showing you seeing here is already been created now by looking by scanning through it's just scanning the whole directory for you so i want to go 2012 you go 2012 it's got a five three videos at the moment for 2012 is keep on scanning it so it will have a quite many so it's all depends upon how you how you have it so what you will notice that you know because it's all configuring it now itself now you have as you notice that there was a movie folder created movie movie icon just created right here for you so it's going to have all these movies inside so what will happen once you select the movie thing it automatically updates the list on the top right there as well just to show you what has been running, what has been recently updated. So you, what you can do actually, you keep on putting movies in your network hard drive and you can access it on Huddle on your tablet or any Android tablet. So that's just what I wanted to show you that how it works on XPMC. So it's exactly the same procedure you need to follow any operating system you're using this XPMC uh, software. This is how you can configure them and configure your and NAS drive on it. If you got any more questions, please do let me know. I'm going to put some more, couple of more videos regarding to the XBMC. You can watch, you can watch quite many channels on your XBMC. You know, you can watch your live videos, you can like uh, movies without downloading on your network. I have already got a download, I just wanted to give you the option of it. And, uh, well, quite many things, you know, for free of charge, you know, that's the thing. So nothing, no need to pay. The only thing you need to do is just to understand it. Thank you very much for that. So, Thank you very much for that. that. That was all I was trying to explain to you. I feel what I can show you some titles here. Let's go for the year wise first. Let's go for the year wise. I'll, you see, you see inc it's, it's keep on increasing. You know, the list is keep on increasing. Go to that one. Now, see, it was quite many movies came in. So, it's a that race. I'm going to open that one movie. So you press it here. It just uh, now it says working because it's sometimes because of the way I'm standing on top of the tablet, you know, it's very hard to access things. So let it let it load it. It speed always mattered on your network connection. So let you know if you got quite many movies, you might gonna have a trouble. There you go. So I'll load it and all working. You can do whatever you want for forward and all these things. So it's every, every movie is there right here for you, right, right on your fingertips, being honest with you. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like my video, please hit the like button and please.